Hey guys, this is Balu from Balu Prime and once again welcome you all back for an exciting tutorial. In this tutorial I will show you how we can make characters walk on water in Blender easily. So hope you guys will find the tutorial useful but before going to that if you end up liking this video please click on that like button do share this content and if you are new to this channel consider subscribing my channel and support me. So further without any ado let's begin today's video. So here you can see I am using Blender 2.93 nice. So now let's select everything in this default and by pressing A on the keyboard and delete. Now let's start this by creating a ground plane. So go to this add mesh select a plane here. So now press S and increase the scaling of the plane here like this. Okay. So now press tab to enter edit mode, right click subdivide and let me increase this number of cuts to 100. Now again press tab to exit this edit mode, fine. So now let's import our character along with the animation. So by the way if you want to learn how to add animations onto our characters using Mixamo. You can check the tutor link in the description or click on the i card above. So now let me import that character with the animation. So go to this file, import, it is an fbx file. So select this fbx and let me select this character and import. So now you can see we got the character here. So let me reduce the scaling of this. So press S and reduce the scaling of this character here like this. Okay. So now let me place this character here and also let me move it downwards. Fine. So now if I play this, you can see we got our character with the animation but nothing is happening now. So now select the character first, let me hide out this armature, okay. So now select this plane, come to this physics property, add dynamic paint onto that and type let it be canvas and click on this add canvas. And first surface type change it to waves, okay. And now enable this anti-aliasing also, frame and start end and I will leave to 1 to 250 only and this indicates the time scale speed everything you can check it manually so speed i will reduce this to 0.75 which indicates the speed of the waves movement okay so once these settings are done now select the character add dynamic paint onto that but in type change it to brush so this plane the type is set to canvas and the character we need to set that type to brush now click on this add brush so now if i play this you can see we got water waves here so now select the plane, right click and shade smooth, okay, and let me enable this cavity and shadow also, nice. So now we can see we got our animation done. So if you are happy with the results, then we need to make this simulation. So select the plane, scroll down, come to this cache. So currently it is grayed out because we did not save the file. So we need to save the file in order to get this enabled. So let me save the file first. So now you can see we got option to bake. So simply click on this bake button. So once the bake is done, now let's move on to this material viewport. So help character got the texture already. Let me select this and let me delete that one. And also delete this one also. We don't need that. Let the help be bald. Now select this ground plane. Come to this material properties. Add new material. And let me change this to glass BSDF. Fine. So IQR, let me change this to 1.33 and let me reduce the roughness here a bit. Nice. So if you want to add light in the scene, we can do that. So go to this add light sun. So press GZ to bring the light upwards and press R to rotate. So let me increase the strength to 5. And we need to move on to the render viewport for that. So currently the scene is not looking that much good so let's add hdri so go to this world properties color environment texture and here we can load hdri so let me select an hdri map you can download free hdris from hdri heaven so let me select this one and open image now come to this render properties enable ambient occlusion distance let it be 2 uh, screen space reflections and also enable this refractions Fine, now scroll down to this film and make it transparent. Nice. So now let me select this sun and let me rotate this here like this. Okay, onto the character. Fine. So now if I play this, we can see we got our character walking on water animation ready. So in this way, we can create this effect easily in Blender using dynamic paint. So hope you guys have learned something new from this tutorial. If you have learned anything new, please like, share and subscribe my channel to support me. So we'll meet in the next video. Until then, signing off. Take care. Bye.